Hi, welcome to this lecture. So in this lecture, I'll show you how you can visualize NDVI or normalized difference vegetation index. One of the spectral indices that will show uh, the greenness or the health of a vegetation cover or forest type or greenness of uh, you know uh, vegetation on, on, on a land surface, okay? So the first thing is um, I assume that you have already installed uh, Arch Engine Python API. If not, you can use this part of the script to um, you can uncomment this and just run this uh, to install the Arch Engine Python API. But if you have already done so, you can skip this part. And I've already installed Arch Engine, so I'll skip that. So the next is, um, thing is I will um, import some important libraries here. I'll import the Earth Engine library, uh, the Folium library, and uh, the G Hydro library for data visualization. I'll execute that part of the script. And the next thing is, uh, if you have already authenticated uh, Earth Engine, you can comment this uh, or leave the comment. Uh, if not, you can execute that to authenticate Earth Engine if it, this is the first time you're running um, um, Earth Engine. Otherwise, you can, if you have already authenticated uh, and installed Earth Engine, you can simply initialize it. Initialize by, uh, you know, executing this ee.initialize uh, and then execute that. This will initialize the Earth Engine Python API for you. And the next thing as uh, so always is to uh, import the Folium uh, library and, um, you know, declare the latitude and longitude to kind of you know zoom in a specific location um, on the map and you can also choose whether it's a hybrid or satellite as a background you can execute that and the next thing is write a, a function that calculates um, NDVI so I'll define my function diff and name it get NDVI and my input uh, I'll, I'll name my input as image or you can define it differently it doesn't matter this is the, just a variable and close the curly bracket and colon and then return image dot normalize difference so normalize difference is um, a, a built-in earth engine function that calculates uh, NDVI you need to provide the two bands that are used to calculate the NDVI ratio in this case uh, for Landsat 5, I'll use uh, band 4 and band 3. So this function will automatically calculate NDVI for me. So what I need is just to provide the you know input image, okay? And so image 1, I'll declare this uh, as image 1 and then import my Landsat data. In this case, I'll declare ee.image and um, provide my image ID from the Earth Engine library. So in this case, it's LT05, it's Landsat 5 and Collection 1, uh, which is top of atmospheric reflectance. Um, so I'll have, that means uh, this will import my Landsat data. And I have already wrote a function to calculate NDVI. So what I, I need next is just to combine this function and this image. That means uh, I'll declare this NDVI1 as um, I'll call my get NDVI function, which I've already defined here. So get NDVI, and then I'll provide the input image. So what it does is it will calculate uh, NDVI for me, okay? So then I have NDVI already calculated here, right? So the next thing is I'll define some visualization parameters, some you know color palette for my NDVI and finally display my NDVI using a map.addLayer function here. So my, I'll, I'll call this NDVI1 here and NDVI parameters here, which I've already defined here. And I'll name the layer as NDVI or you can name it differently if you're interested, it doesn't matter. This is just, um, um, just uh, a name you can write a different name here if you're interested too and also adjust the mapping visualization the zoom in so map center object and dvi um, so it will focus um, with this um, you know visualization uh, zoom to um, you know adjust the zoom here 
So I'll execute this part of the code. It's already executed. Say so lastly, I'll import my map visualization here. So I'll have NDVI um, over here, Landsat using uh, computer using Landsat 5. Okay, in a second, I'll execute this map display part. Here you go, excellent. So here is my NDV. Actually, I'll um, okay, turn off the so this is uh, NDVI value for the you know San Francisco Bay Area here. So I've calculated NDVI using Landsat 5. Um, so, so the green areas, the high, the, the deep green areas uh, indicate more like dense vegetation cover here. If I actually toggle the the um, land, the satellite background, you can see the forest area over here. You can zoom in and just you know see the difference forest area. Uh, so having a higher NDVI values over here, as you can see and uh, the other parts more sparse vegetation you can see um, you know lower NDVI um, more yellow, green yellowish um, so um, so this is how you can calculate NDVI for a single you know Landsat scene um, using the Earth Engine Python API